Hello guys, this is Gideon Awolisi and welcome back to Crypto Watch. Today we're going to be talking about minting NFT on OpenSea. I'm going to put you through a step-by-step -step guide on how you can mint your very first NFT on the OpenSea platform. Yes, I know OpenSea has been around for a while and uh, this is probably coming late, but there are some people out there that do not know anything about NFTs, that do not know anything about minting on OpenSea and do not know how to use the OpenSea platform. Today, I'm going to put you through a step-by-step -step guide on how to mint your very first NFT on the OpenSea platform. Yeah, what are NFTs? This is standard procedure. I've talked about NFTs before on my channel. You can check the link up above in the video. Uh, but basically, NFTs are non fungible tokens that uh, are indivisible and they represent uh, possession of a particular digital item on the blockchain. They are minted uh, in form of a uh, in tokens attached to either digital images, uh, songs, uh, various various different things on the blockchain that just tries to uh, show that the particular holder of this NFT token owns this token on the blockchain. It is stamped and verified on the blockchain that this is the owner of a particular token. NFT tokens uh, are very very useful in representing ownership in terms of uh, using uh, them for situations like governance. For instance, if we were to move voting uh, like we do in the United States or in African countries, if we are going to move ballot voting to the blockchain, NFT would represent an individual signature. You would understand that this NFT belongs to this particular person. It will show that uh this signature this vote this uh token it belongs to one unique person it cannot be divided it cannot be multiplied it cannot be divisible in any way so it can be useful in terms of governance it can be useful in terms of real estate for instance if you have a, a real estate platform and you want to move it to the blockchain each piece of land each documentation can be represented in form as an or in form of an nft so there are so many use cases out there for NFT. They use it for DAO, use it for games, use it for, for using it in the metaverse. So, so many different places that you can use your NFT. So, uh, what is OpenSea? You're, we're trying to mint an NFT on OpenSea. What exactly is this OpenSea that you've been hearing about? What exactly is this OpenSea that people keep talking about? OpenSea is one of the very first, if not the first, one of the very first uh, NFT marketplaces. A marketplace, an NFT marketplace is a place where you can come to buy and sell NFT on the platform. Why are you buying tokens? Why are you buying tokens representing images, tokens representing songs, tokens representing different things? What exactly? Why do you need to buy them? Well, uh, the very first uh, uh, recognizable NFT uh, that was created was, I think, around in 2017, the uh, Crypto Punks. These punks were the very first ones that actually gained a lot of traction. They represented uh, the ownership of these images, this set, this collection on the blockchain and it, it gave a, a kind of uh, access a kind of uh, a kind of ownership of these tokens that was represented on the blockchain to these people that had these tokens for instance uh, people that create art and put them digitally on the blockchain they can uh, make them into nfts and it can be sold on the marketplace now most people buy token why do people buy uh, nfts on the marketplace but most people buy these things in hopes of uh, of them going higher later on why exactly do you buy crypto why exactly do you buy stocks why do you buy coins why do you buy forex because you're hoping that whatever you're buying will go up later on and nfts are only as valuable as what someone else is willing to pay for them except the ones that actually have a uh, functional use cases like in terms of DAO and governance so most NFTs, they are being bought and resold, bought and resold in hopes for a higher return on investment later on. Now, uh, the problem that you can face when you're trying to mint NFT on OpenSea is the issue of gas fees. Ethereum, OpenSea uses Ethereum mainly as its method of minting uh, NFT. What happens is that you take your image that you want to mint, you put it on the platform, you, you upload it onto the platform and then it is minted and fused together with a token. 
usually it's not uh, most of these platforms do not actually host these images on the blockchain because it would cost an exorbitant amount of gas fees but instance what they do is that they link the token to a url containing the image that has been minted now because of ethereum high gas fees right now it's it's actually very expensive for you to mint on OpenSea, but there is a solution and that is using the polygon network and i'm going to show you how you can mint your very first nft on OpenSea using the matic polygon network let's get started so now right now here we are on the open c website this is open c you can see explore stats resources create and this is my profile this is my wallet so if i come down you can see discover collect and sell extraordinary nfts on the world's first and largest nft marketplace so if you click on explore you will be check out all the nfts on the open sea platform now this is showing the notable drops these are some of the i think these are actually sponsored because these are some of the most recent ones that uh that have been notable on the platform i'm sure they're probably very very expensive but these are the top collections over the last seven days uh, these collections are based on their floor prices now we have the sandbox the sandbox is actually really really high the floor price is 15,342. Whoa, that's serious. And then we have the Wolf game. Uh, the uh, floor price is 11,900. That's basically 12,000. The floor price is basically saying that this is the lowest you can get. This is the lowest price that these NFTs are being sold for. So imagine if you had gotten the sandbox early on and you probably got 10. And right now, the lowest is being sold for is 15,342. The lowest uh, uh, price that has been placed on the marketplace for these NFT is 15,342. Now, this is Crypto Coupon, the very first one. And for some reason, it has been dipping recently. The floor price is about 6,000. And for and ninety-four, uh, I think yeah, six thousand and ninety-four. Is this six? I think it's six thousand and ninety-four Ethereum, not dollars. <laughs> wow, this is serious. Let's check it out. Let's be sure. We'll check out crypto punks. The floor price. Okay, three point two thousand people. That's three thousand two hundred people own this ten ten thousand uh, NFTs. And the volume traded is seven hundred twenty-six thousand. Uh, seven Ethereum has been traded. So okay, okay, okay. It's uh, it's dollars because right now you can see floor price as ten point four nine Ethereum, zero point seven nine Ethereum. This is actually is still very cheap. So uh, twenty three point nine nine Ethereum and several others. 33 ethereum so right now what, what we are seeing there was the value in dollars not in uh not in not in ethereum so i think this is the value this is the value right now probably he's talking about the top prices there's not it's not i don't know why the floor price is not shown at this point we can check the so you can come to uh, any project page here you see you can check the information the activity you can check the website and check the discord twitter and others so if you want to check the activity of the uh, of the collection right now you can see uh, crypto punk had a spike here on october 28 so basically the it has just been a uh, a very very slow movement that's not been buying and selling for a while now this one was sold for 86.8 ethereum so yeah these are the these are the prices that these things have been going for so this was 283,467 uh, ethereum is 90 day volume for the crypto pump. these are the sales so you can filter according to whatever it is you want to Whatever it is we want to find out. This is it. These are the sales. These are the prices. 94, 84 Ethereum. So these are the prices. But let's get back to uh, meeting our very first NFT on the OpenSea platform. We're going to meet our very first NFT right now. 
So these are the top collections, trending all categories, create and sell your NFTs, resources. You can just go through these pages. So these are the things that you can uh, use your NFT to do. You can uh, mint your NFT as an art. You can mint your NFT with uh, music. You can mint a domain name NFT. You can mint collectibles, trading cards, virtual worlds, metaverses, uh, sports, utility, and basically all NFTs. So these are the things that you can do with your NFT. But today we are going to talk about how to create your very first NFT on the OpenSea marketplace so right now we're going to use my metamax I'm going to blur this out I'm going to use my metamax to connect to the smart to the uh, OpenSea platform so uh, the metamax notification will pop up for you to sign in to the platform so this is what it's going to do. You're going to just click on the sign, sign in, and then you're definitely in. So to show uh, openc.io slash assets slash create. So you're going to create the new item. So it depends on what you want to do. You can create an image, you can create video, you can create audio or a 3D model, depending on what you want to make, depending on the NFT you want to make. But for the purpose of this video, I'm going to mint this NFT of the African image that I designed on figma so here it is so i'm going to call it uh hello africa so yeah this is my this is the image i want to make as an nft so now this external link it depends it depends on what you want to do some people uh, create these uh images in high quality in high jpeg and uh the owners because of the fact that OpenSea will minimize the image size um to minimize the, minimize the image quality and reduce the image quality some people actually put the link they will host the image on an external host and then put the link link to the image or the file or the music or whatever it is that they want them to download they will put it here so once you've paid for the nft you will have access to this link to actually download the original file <clears throat> So here you put the description. What description? Um, a silhouette. Let me just put a silhouette uh, of the African image. So you can uh, add it to a collection. I have. You can create a collection. That's uh, that's something for another day. But for the purpose of this video, we're not creating a collection. We just want to mint you can also add properties and uh, levels and stats unlockable content like different different things that you can add to it so this supply you can uh, change the supply but you cannot change the supply if it's on ethereum or if it's on polygon this is how you change it to polygon matic you change the polygon you can make it five in supply you can make it as much as possible in supply but i'm just creating one supply so there's only going to be one of these content on the OpenSea marketplace so then you come here you click on create the next thing is uh it has been created very very simple very very straightforward and your nft is ready what next what else do you do next thing to do is to put it on sale how much will you sell it for so you can choose different uh you can uh choose the uh the price you want to sell the uh image for let me just put a uh, 0 0.1 i want to sell this uh, nft for 0 0.1 ethereum i'll put it on sale for six months service fee 2.5 percent and then i'll click on complete listing so send the message in my wallet and everything will be completed and just like that i have minted my nft i have listed my nft on the OpenC platform i can sell it anyone can come on there click on the buy button and then i get my money into my wallet easily straightforward no stress make your money and mint your nft on the platform where can you advertise your nft you've minted your nft what's the next step are you just going to leave it there you can click on here to share the nft on uh, twitter share it on facebook share it on telegram copy the links share it to your email subscribers share it to your youtube subscribers i'm going to put the link to this nft in the description below in case anyone wants to get it so you can share it anywhere and even one clicks on the link and comes onto the OpenSea platform they will be able to purchase 
this nft so uh this is how you can mint your nft on the OpenSea platform it's easy it's straightforward it costs zero 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 fees you don't have to pay money for anything you can mint your nft and get earnings from selling nft on the open sea platform uh, guys do not forget as usual if you enjoyed this video you just click on the like button subscribe and turn on notifications because my videos always come packed with crypto knowledge with information that will help you click on the like subscribe button turn on notifications share this video to your friends they need it because everyone needs to make money and this crypto this crypto is an opportunity for us to get into it and you share it with your uh, with your friends will empower your circle on how to make money from cryptocurrencies and grow together and together make money together i'll see you guys in the next video peace out